how am I doing? I've just been the star of three non-commissioned TV pilots. A couple of years ago I was nominated for a Foster's Lager Award and I've just put down the first payment on this bad boy and I can't even drive. So you tell me, how am I doing? saw my first comedian um, and it just changed my life. Um, people were walking out on him, throwing chairs at him, you know, shouting abuse at him, telling him he was shit. And I just knew right then and there that that's what I wanted to do with my life. We can get some Chris from the petrol station. Uh, any old cunt can win. You know, it's just a case of being better than everyone else. But acknowledging you're not as good and still getting up and doing it? If you can do that, then you will never truly lose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was tough growing up. I mean, name me one kid that didn't find it tough growing up. I mean, there was never enough money. There was never any money. Uh, and I think that's what really kind of made me. That was my driving force. That's what helped me to keep going forward. That's what inspired me, the desire to get out of the hole I was in. Uh, and that's kind of what made me who I am today. You know, plus at the age of 18, uh, my dad revealed he'd been putting it all in a trust fund for us. And, you know, we had loads of money after that. I mean, loads of it, too much. <laughs> Sometimes I feel like a bird of prey and I just want to fly away. Fly away, away from it all. But I can't because people keep praying to me, praying to me for help, praying for salvation. And I have to come back, I have to come back and help them. I have to come back and help them and save them like some sort of superhero or a, or a bird of prey. People look at me and treat me like I'm something special. I'm nothing special, I'm just like you guys. I put my cat suit on one leg at a time and then the arms. Do I think of myself as a hero? I have to. I have to. I'm one of the few people that's willing to stand up for what I believe in and do what I do really well. There's no use in pretending I'm a nobody anymore. I've got responsibility to these people. They've come, they've paid their money for an hour of entertainment out of their fucking pathetic lives. Every year I say it's going to be my last year, but they haven't stopped me yet. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm scared, but what am I going to do? Admin? I'm unemployable. I'm going to put on the best show anyone has ever seen with their eyes and ears. I've said I'm doing it. I've got to do it. Because when you say you're going to do something, you've got to go ahead and do it. You can't let down people's expectations. You know, even if it kills you. One man, man. <laughs>